Hello everybody, and I want to show you today another uh, another types you can uh, add a v uh, live radio and embed this live radio uh, using uh, an embedding code on the HTML website or PHP or whatever. And I using Southcast for my live radio, and I using uh, WinApp too. So uh just show you on my website what this look like after it's look like this that's live radio and uh, it's streaming my my radio live over here you have a couple players you can use uh, windows media player quicktime real player flash player and another application for the live radio in uh, lan in my lan and um over here I have a couple playlists. This is the same playlist, it's only different extension uh, using a PLS for QuickTime and Real Player and uh, M3U for Windows Media Player Streaming. And uh, basically this is the same code here I using for uh, my Windows Media Player and QuickTime it's another code uh, it's another code for Windows Media Player. Uh, no, sorry, QuickTime Player, and uh, Real uh, Real Player. It's another thing too, and it's really a nice Real Player. It's a good player for music and video. And you have a Flash Player over here, and the LAN Player. It's basically the same of the Windows Media Player, but different uh, uh, in link for the internet radio. So basically, how can you do that? Uh, you can create a HTML page like that, and uh, put a link, put the embed code right there. It's looked like nice. So how can I do this embed code? Okay, I go on Google. Oh, sorry. And type um, embed generator, and select uh, the the first one. Embed media HTML generator. So here you have four different things you can uh, select. So use Windows Media Player first. And uh, here I just write my server name to radio. Dot dot web dot net. Uh, I write this one because um, it's uh, the the one I use. But if you have another one, you can use uh, your LAN IP here. Uh, example, this or whatever. If if you have a, a D-Link router or a Linksys router, you can uh, just type your IP over here. Or like me, I type radio .net. It's my DNS name, and use your port over here, and make sure it's the good port. And after that, um, you have the file path over here. You stay empty this boxy, and the dimension you can use uh, the dimension over here like you want. It's a movie or something like that, but right now it's a music and it's a radio, so you can put a higher like uh, 50. And uh, start automatically, show control, loops playback, yeah, it looks nice in the center, so I click submit. And this is give me the, the code for the embed radio. So I copy that. And uh, I open this in that pad over here and paste the code the entire code so basically it's simple uh, you have um, your link over here with your port you have another one over here with your port too and you have another one here with your port so uh, if I say port I say like this because um, sometimes it's uh, it's different you can put this port over here me I do another thing so you save that uh, you save this code it's the HTML page so you put in all file over here and save 
I like a HTML file, so radio.html and put that on my desktop. So I double click on it to see what this looked like. Oh, this looked like that. There we go. So it's uh, embedding my radio. It's very nice. So uh, yeah, it's not easy. It's uh, it's it's easy. It's not uh, hard to do, and uh, it's only that uh, code embedding in the live radio. So after you make sure all the port on your computer, on your computer in the firewall, it's open, and all the firewalls in your router it's open. Uh, example eight zero 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 and uh, in your firewall the same thing uh, you make sure all is okay and you are able to stream on the internet uh, on the internet for a worldwide uh, radio live like me so if you have other comments if you want uh, give me a, uh, some ID to do some video about a computer and network uh, leave me comments on this video and I'll give you a follow-up soon I as I can. Thank you. Have a, a nice day. Bye-bye.